I'm Janet McCallum and my quilt is called Time and Tide. The inspiration was the rusty end of Eastbourne Pier. Um, I moved to Eastbourne about two years ago and uh, I did go to art school there a long time ago. But I moved back to Eastbourne and I just love the end of the pier. <laughs> so it changes all the time and the colours when the sea is sparkling it's just, it's just gorgeous down there. My default, uh, when I'm making fabric or colouring fabric, my default is to do turquoise and rust coloured. So some of these fabrics, I, I actually died about 10 years ago. So I have okay. a very large stash of fabrics and every now and again something sparks. Um, and I took a photo of the rusty bits and I thought, yes, that's exactly, that will fit this turquoise dyed bit yeah. back, which was pole wrapped. And then I had a whole load of um, these other turquoise, uh, rust colored fabrics. This was soy wax resist. Um, that is the reverse of this fabric here. These, um, that was just ordinary bucket dyed. Mm -hmm. And I think I, uh, that might even have been a combination both the rust and the turquoise, so it's between both colours. This was mono printed um, onto uh, a brown background. I then made a pattern with my fingers onto plastic. It was inspired by Nancy Crow's exhibition here a few years ago, and then I mono printed from the plastic onto the rust colour. That's a, that's a potato. <laughs> it's a, a, a mixture of quite a few techniques. Well, I love showing it off. <laughs> I have entered the, the Festival of Quilts uh, nearly every time uh, since the first show. And I haven't ever won anything. I've had three judges' choices, but I was I, I had high hopes for this one, but there you go. I'm very fond of it. I was uh, I was at uh, I was hooked in the late seventies by the begin that revival of quilting. Then there was a television program. I think in nineteen eighty something and and I um, I started with ooh, over papers as most people did and I just moved um, my moved on to art quilts. I, I am a graphic designer so I've got the art training and I no longer use paint I use fabric. Fabric is uh, a very tactile mm medium to work in and you've got the added dimension of the, the texture as well and quite honestly this could be paper uh, except that I can add stitch to this I mean it is it is a completely collage technique it's all raw edged uh, no turning in edges no plenty of rough edges and threads and so on so I'm not precious about that but it's going on the wall it's not going on the bed I've made so many friends it's uh, yeah it's great and I also love the collaborative uh, element of it as well